Hello everybody, welcome to Sand Plum Farm. In this video we're going to be talking about uh, my Harbor Freight 10 by 17 portable garage and how I turned it into a chicken coop uh, to overwinter my chickens and ducks. Uh, stick with us and we'll talk about it here in just a minute. is what this thing looks like uh, nowadays after let's see we're going to be going into the third winter and two summers of use um, I guess the question that everybody's going to be asking is 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 this thing worth buying and I would say for a temporary solution if you buy it by itself um, and don't take precautions to uh, to protect the tarps from uh, um, from the UV light I would say you might get six months out of it and you can see that that a lot of uh, damage has been done over the course of three years because it hasn't been uh, it hasn't been adequately protected uh, I bought two of these at the same time and uh, um, basically made over the course of the years have made one functional garage out of two uh, and uh, I've just recovered it and recovered it and recovered it and finally we put this greenhouse plastic over the over the outside to keep the weather out um, and uh, I'm cleaning it out we just uh, we just uh, the last thing that was in here was a group of ducks that we butchered and uh, it's it works fine for a place to keep things but I would say if I had it over had it to do over again I would probably invest a little bit more money uh, in something that was a little bit more permanent. This is the this is the front end of the 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 garage door is rolled up there, and uh, we built kind of a frame here uh, to uh, to put a gate on and to stretch some uh, stretch the chicken wire over. Um, and that seems to have held up really well, um, considering it's raw wood, untreated wood. Uh, all we did was, uh, sandwiched, um, sandwich the zipper and the opening between two one befores and, uh, screwed them together, uh, up here on the top as well and then kind of built this frame and then stretched uh, stretched chicken wire over it um, I don't know for the amount of money I have in it I'm very surprised that it's lasted as long as it has um, and I intend on getting probably one more winter out of it before we retire it, uh, the retire, it, but its life won't be over even after that. Let's see here. What we're going to do and I'm going to go ahead and do this with the other frame that I have, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to take uh, all of the tarps off of this thing and uh, in the spring I'm going to stretch the greenhouse plastic back over it and uh, we will have two frames that can be used for basically a hoop house and uh, um, extend our growing season in our garden that way. Uh, I don't know. I apologize for the quality of this video. This is one of the first that I've ever shot. Um, 
of me talking but I hope to get better and if you found this video informative at all or helped you out press the like button and uh, subscribe if you'd like to and we'd appreciate it I appreciate your time and have a blessed day